can't be a night owl if you want to be a gym rat. That's from a new study published in the journal called Sleep. Researchers say that some people who stay up late spend more time during the day sitting and less time motivated to exercise. The feds recommend that adults get at least two and a half hours of exercise each week, but they say more than half of people do not get those guidelines or meet them. Health officials say physical inactivity is one of the leading risk factors for premature death around the world. Trainer Nicole Glor joins us on the Fox News deck. She is the founder of the website NikkiFitness.com. Good to see you. Good to see you. So I stay up late, but I get up and hit the gym. So to me, this sounds like... <coughs> You have the best of both worlds, but really the early bird gets the workout when it comes right. to working late. If you work late and you know that's your schedule, then you, sometimes you make it happen. But if you just like to stay up late, sometimes you won't be motivated if you're not forcing yourself to get up and run at 5.30 in the morning. Yeah, if you're still behind the bar at, at 2 o'clock in the exactly. morning, it's hard to run at 5 a.m. It is. Hangovers are just one of the many reasons why people are not motivated to work out. Also, you know, you have chores to do or errands to do the next day. Maybe your friend's in town. Maybe a business meeting pops up. If your workout, it can only happen at 11 a.m. The post office is open. You have things to do. Whereas if you get up early and work out before 8 a.m., nobody else is encroaching on your schedule. Your right. schedule is yours. Of course, the gym is full then. That's true. With all those ne'er to wells. Well, that's another problem though, because if you live somewhere where gyms don't have great classes at 9 p.m. or 11 p.m. at night, when you want to work out, then you have to look at other things like DVDs and, and workout buddies, where you can make it work with your schedule. You need a, you need a buddy or a trainer, don't you? Absolutely. Hey, she, Nicole's got uh, five points that I, that I want to bring up here. Uh, call for FS number one. See you in the booth. Uh, get motivated. That, that's, that's the first, you gotta get motivated. It is. And one of the tricks I like is a book. Maybe you want to sit on the couch and read a book. How about get an audio book so you can only work out and listen to that book at the same time. You can't find out what happens to that killer unless you're out on the treadmill, you know. Book on the elliptical. Yeah. Number two, caffeine. Green tea, five hour energy, do it. It's whatever you need to get a little boost in your step. It not only helps you feel more energized to work out, but also there's been studies that say it makes your workout more powerful, you burn more calories, you last longer in your workout. Number three, go to bed early. But you know, if you get up working out in the morning and you do it every day, you'll want to go to bed earlier. For one thing, you're tired earlier, but the other, tired. you don't want that pain in the morning. Exactly. You don't want the pain in the morning. You'll feel like you want to fall asleep closer to 10 o'clock or 9 o'clock, and you'll sleep soundly through the night because your body needs to recover. You won't be waking up every time you hear a noise. Now, here's this next one I really like. Uh, number four, sleep in your workout clothes. I don't know if I could do that. Well, you know, if you just have a t-shirt and sh shorts, socks yeah. on, you can sleep like that. Oh, so you don't mean that you, you don't mean the, 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 the gym shoes too? No, you just uh, put your gym shoes next to your bed. Okay. You put your workout music, your playlist, your headphones, your keys, whatever you need, your water bottle next to your bed. You wake up, you see it, you say, all right, I know I'm meant to do this. I got to make it happen. And it's just easy. You save time. You put your stuff together, brush your teeth and get out the door. And number five, get a personal, get a buddy or a, or a workout partner or a personal trainer. Got to do it. Nicole, great to see you.